I would imagine the women in their evening dresses and the men in their tuxedos. And baby, I wanted more than anything to be in that room. You sound like a little girl right now. Maybe I do. For seven figures a month, baby, this world will be whatever the fuck we want it. Yes. Mm. Yes. Mm. Yes. Get these people killed to make them into killers. I promise you that. Not everybody who gets in this game ends up dropping bodies, Jerome. Got in this game to get rich, right? Right? Louis, we there. You got cars, you got clothes, you got jewelry. You even got that club you wanted. The fuck else you need? It's not just about what I need. Then what is it about, then, Cleopatra? What's the word, y'all? It's Davion seen it. I had to give y'all a video real quick on my break. I felt the need to take advantage. So if you're new, hit that like and subscribe button. Today, we're going to be talking about how Aunt Louie is going to be Uncle Jerome's downfall. Let's get right into it. So you remember in the pilot episode of season one, when Aunt Louie basically snuck Franklin to go make his first transaction with Claudia, and then she ends up getting assaulted. And then Jerome blames Franklin for Louie getting assaulted, but Aunt Louie doesn't even say nothing because she was the one that took Franklin over to make his first transaction. Okay, remember in episode six, season one, we're talking about season one, I'm about to make a connection. Remember in episode six, when Jerome and Franklin and Aunt Louie was basically talking about the coke and how business can go down, whatever. And Jerome was trying to warn Franklin, trying to stir him away. Be careful what you're playing with, boy. Words from the um, wise Bokeem Woodbine. He killed that scene, by the way. So all along, and this is the reason why I'm keep saying that Jerome and Franklin, because Jerome never wanted any parts of the drug game. You see in season one, I'm going to post up a clip where Bokeem Woodbine's character is telling Franklin about how he, I'm going to show you. I'm going to post it up in a minute. But I bring that up just to state that Jerome doesn't want anything to do with the coke business. It was Aunt, Aunt Louie's idea to get in the business. Because in episode eight, season one, remember, do you? You can go back. I might put up a video. I might not. But season one, episode eight, when things started popping off, Aunt Louie went through this whole trip down memory lane of how she was a little kid and how she seen all this, this fancy stuff. She starts bribing Jerome to get in the drug game. And Jerome responds saying like, I don't even, this, we have a good life right here. Why can't I just sell weed? But this ain't good enough for you, huh? So once, once Louie starts, you know, you know how women do Starts um, feeling on Jerome, touching on him, you know, giving him that soft spot, that soft touch, telling him that this world will be whatever the, it, they want it to be and bringing in seven figures a week. You know, Jerome, you can see he didn't really, I'm sorry, don't forget, that's the toilet, I'll stop. I need y'all to hear this. Jerome, you can kind of see his face. He's kind of like, mm, all right. Okay, season two, episode four. Jerome and Louis have an argument and there's one one saying in the argument there's one thing Jerome said in the argument I didn't even want to be in this game I did it for you now season three you see Jerome and Aunt Louis you know they they you know they're getting their bag up you know they owning things episode episode nine season three Aunt Louis Starts having a little bit of self, you know, um, have some self guilt because she was the one that brought Franklin to the club. I think, was that season three? I'm the one that brought him to the club. She starts telling Jerome that. And you can tell that Jerome, you know, he wants to make his money, but he wants to focus just on his shop. That's all. He got in this game just focused on, focused on his shop. And the one thing he says is the only thing we need to focus on is surviving. 
Episode six. I'm making a connection here. Episode six, season three, towards the end of that episode. Is it episode episode six? Franklin and Jerome are having a conversation. No, no, this is episode five. I apologize. Episode five. Franklin and Jerome having a conversation, and Franklin is basically commending Jerome for stepping up and well, taking that. Before you say anything, I just wanted to say I appreciate you. I know a lot of people take a beating like that. They want out the game. Concerned about my shop, nephew. Put a lot of money in that thing. I needed to work out. You and Sissy, you got the real estate thing. Louis got the club. Damn it, Jerome. That's my shit. Need to give him a full attention. Can't be no old nigga out here slinging rocks on the block, man. And that's why I'm trying to get this wholesale thing going. So we can make that money and never have to be on the street. Eating and whatever. And you see Jerome's face like dog. I'm gonna let that go. Like, dog, bro, I can't be no old nigga out here slanging rock. You got real estate with Sissy, Louie got the club, Jim and Jerome, that's my shit. I gotta give him my full attention. So this, all this, all, all these episodes and moments of Jerome not really wanting to be in the drug game is in the case that already. But Aunt Louie is the total opposite. You see what I'm talking about? She wants to find the things in life. So, oh man, I wish there was that. Whatever. So, um, now we fast forward. So, with all that going down, and I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm missing a few other segments. But what I'm trying to get y'all to see is that you see how Jerome doesn't want no part of the business. And you see Louie, she just wants all. That's going to make that. Um, listen, Aunt Louie's going to be Jerome's downfall. Because... He's doing everything he can to support her in every moment. Even when she got beat up by Claudia, he came to her rescue. Jerome always comes to Louis' rescue. He was willing to get killed by Man Boy and all of them. About to go down to the barbershop and get outgunned and gunned down just for Louis. Jerome is wrapped around Louis' finger. Now, this is going to, now I know this sounds correct, but listen, just hear me out. If Jerome ends up getting knocked off at the end of this season or next season, oh yeah, it's going to have something to do with Aunt Louie. Now you see what she just did at the end of last episode, how she set up Kane to get shot up by Buckley. Now we know Kane is not going to die. We already know. And the reason I say that he's not going to die is because... In the season, in the, in the episode nine trailer, you see Louis and Jerome, I'm sorry, Jerome and Leon conversing. And all Leon says is, I hope you're ready for what's about to come. So now, you done started some stuff. And so now, if Uncle Jerome gets killed, it's going to be your fault. Just think about it. Now, there is one episode that just popped into mind, and that's episode three of this season. Episode three. Towards the end, when Franklin blacked out on, on um, Aunt Louie. Now, pay attention to what she said. Pay attention to that first part of the conversation. Louie states that I don't want to risk my, our life, and then you see Jerome, and then Franklin catches on, and, Jerome, and he says, boom. Because separating from me wasn't Jerome's idea. Even though he don't want to be in the drug game, but he just want to keep it simple. Jer Louis, she doing a whole bunch of other stuff. See, Jerome just wants to keep things simple, and Louis just does too much. And that's why she'll end up being his downfall, because I haven't seen him really put his foot down to Louis as much as the prior seasons, but I feel like it's going to cost him. I feel like she's going to be the reason. She's going to be the reason this family fractures. I'm calling it right now. It's not really Franklin. It, I mean, Franklin has his own issues, and we know he's a control freak or whatever. But Louis is going to play a big part of why this family is going to fracture. 
you, you'll see tonight. You'll see how tonight goes down, and then you'll see how the season finale goes down next one. Keep watching. But anyway, that's my prediction. Um, y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. Hit the like and subscribe button. Let's get my channel up to 2,000. I'm at 1,900 something subscribers, man, because of y'all. Because y'all keep watching and y'all keep liking and subscribing. I appreciate y'all. Y'all the best. Y'all stay watching my videos. I know y'all uh, um, y'all be waiting for it. And that just really makes me feel proud. But please show my Abbott Elementary video some love. Please, please. But anyway, I'm going to get off this. Y'all be easy out there, yeah? Out there, yeah? Out there, y'all. Snowfall tonight. Episode 9 departures. It's going to be lit. Stay tuned, y'all. I'm up out of here. I'll see y'all tonight at 10.